Follow the Rule is a very unique concept. It's a coffee cafe where in the daytime you can come and taste delicious pastries, have some paninis, sit and work on your computer, having a great cup of coffee. But it also is a place where you can reserve a spot to put on an event of your own. You can come and rent the space to have a dinner that is tailored exactly to what your needs are. It's kind of a place that has encompasses everything. I'll be having cooking classes here. I'll be doing uh, painting classes so you can do paint and sip and have tapas. So she has um, all the materials you're going to need. Um, she gives you the menus and all of the ingredients and then she goes through and explains what it is and how you're going to make it. Um, and then after each course you sit down and eat it and then you go back and you do another one. It's not a rigid format. Very comfortable. Doing a thing called a pop-up op where I'm having culinary students who are really rising star chefs come and have a place for them to have their own restaurant if only just for one night. You won't believe how good this is. You'll sit down and you'll think, oh it's just an everyday burrito. But I promise you, it'll probably be the best one you've ever had. Follow the Rule is great for somebody who has always wanted to put on the ultimate dinner party at their home, but just didn't have the tools to do so. They can just call me up and I'll put together a dinner, a five course, six course dinner, pair it with wines, give even wine educations, and their friends will be talking about it for years. Last year I released my first cookbook called Passions of a Restaurateur. They're basically stories of the years of restaurateuring from my family starting from the 1800s up until, well, today. And each story that was written, there was a, a catalyst of, of a recipe that was actually attached to the story. One of my favorite things to do is to take a winemaker or a brewmaster or a distiller take his art, his or her art, and try to find a way to make it taste even better. Therefore, in turn, making my food taste even better. Food and beverage pairing dinners are not just found at Fall the Rule itself. You can also find them at wineries. Take my entourage to a winery, build a kitchen there, and amongst the barrels and amongst the vines, you can have um, ulti an ultimate five course, six course dinner paired with the grape wines of the producer where we are. We can do it also in breweries, at distilleries. There is just nothing like it. My biggest influence in my career was my father. My father was born in 1893, he was 67 when I was born. That being said, he, he had gobs of experience to pass on to me. Years of restaurant experience, years of owning particular restaurants, and even growing up in an Italian kitchen. It, it gave me a, a base that, that no school could ever replace. And I think if he saw Follow the Rule, he would be very, very proud. And I think you would find that talking with her, having her serve you, would be a pleasurable experience. And even in this small little venue here, probably be better than even if it was the big restaurant that she actually had before because you'll probably experience her a little bit more and more intimately. So I think it'll be a great time for anybody to come in here and enjoy. It's not just enjoying her food, it's enjoying her. I should stay, I would only be in your way, so goodbye. Okay, anyway. <laughs>